Right, now with that assault in Brooklyn, four people are under arrest, accused of attacking an Orthodox Jewish man in Borough Park. Happened early this morning on 18th Avenue and East 2nd Street. And right now, the attack is being investigated as a possible bias crime. Eyewitnesses reporter Anthony Johnson's live now in Borough Park with the story for us. Anthony? Well, Laurie, we got word about this arrest about 8 o'clock this morning. We were the first to get that word. As you said, they are investigating this as a possible bias crime. Now, members of the Orthodox community have gathered here outside of the 66 police precinct, and they tell me this morning they are thrilled about these arrests. Now, the victim was apparently heading home from work around 2.30 this morning when he was apparently surrounded. That was over at 18th near Seton. He thought he was going to become the latest victim and what has been known around the country as knockout attacks. Somehow, this victim escaped serious injury, got assistance from the local community Jewish police. They got in touch with the NYPD, rushing to the scene. They made the arrests of four suspects. Those four suspects are now being interviewed here at the 66 police precinct. The message that we need to send is that we're going to have zero tolerance, and that's why I've called on the NYPD and the district attorney's office to literally throw the book at these individuals and to charge them with many crimes, including hate crimes and gang assault, because that's what it is. Now, with the knockout attacks taking place in this community, also over in Crown Heights, they have been very concerned about anything People going outside. As a matter of fact, one gentleman told me there was supposed to be a big event involving girls in this community this weekend. That event had to be canceled because of fear in the community. So once again, they are very happy that these four individuals have been taken into custody. So far, the NYPD has not told us the charges. It seems like it's going to be quite a while before we actually see these four gentlemen taken out of the 66th precinct. That's the latest live from Brooklyn. Anthony Johnson, Channel 7. Witness News.